He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. No, no, I want to carry on talking. I've got something special for you. Is oh, that so? Okay. Now, what would that be? Your favorite, Savior Schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Five Savior Schnapps. Brilliant. Can I sell them? It has been a long day. But I have everything done. I've got all of the tasks. I've got the ale. And I figured out that my right hand hates me and cannot be trusted. Dad. About the things you wanted. Please just uh, don't ask time. anything about it. Have you got everything I wanted? Yes. Yes. Yes, I have. Start forging. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. You parted with the cro- Right. Okay. Let's see what kind of job the master in Sasal did for us. <laughs> Look at that, lad. Well, that's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? Oh, damn if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Radzig ordered it. Oh, this will be the finest sword I've ever made. We got the charcoal. Good. Then fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. By the way, someone paid me a call. I reckon you might know what it was about. Okay. I'm not sure. Really? Because I'm pretty sure you and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed house. He was here with the catchpole earlier, and it was not a friendly visit. What got into you, Hal? That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the King. He got what he deserved. Got what he deserved, did he? You can go and clean up the mess you made and apologize to him. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. You understand? Yes, Dad. Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. Good. And we'll never have this conversation again. Ooh, I will hold you to that. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of our king? <laughs> the boy gets caught making a fool of himself and he still hasn't learned his lesson. So Deutsch spouts rubbish and what? You turn into a common thug. You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth and not your fists. I did try. The drunkard wouldn't give it me, the, the money, that is. And I had to help the guys out so they'd help me out Fairness get the money back. Ready. Right, we'll do the grip. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. God, I hope so. Just don't let my right hand get involved, okay? Otherwise you'll end up with an apple on the end or something, right? It just, it's not gonna go well. Do it. Oh, that looks hot. Good. Once more. That's it. Done. Now, file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. 
And here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles, had a bridge made over the Moldau and founded a university, and all without a war. He knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. The... Are you all right? <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, trunk in the living room. Go and get the nails for Teresa. OK, so we've made a sword. I know it's not for me, but oh my god, I want it. That was oddly hypnotic. Just. Is... I mean, that's the only trunk I know. Didn't he say the living... Oh. Is that a... Yeah, okay. Nails for today... Ooh. Marigold decoction. Sh bandage! Uh, okay. Let's take... Let's take that. Take the bandage. Should we take the bandages? I think I probably need them more than anyone else. Marigold decoction? What on earth is... That. Within one minute will cure light wounds or dispel hangover effects. Oh, I should have, I should have, you know, I shouldn't be stealing this from my uh, family, should I? No, I shouldn't. I got the nails. That's the important thing. I got the nails. I've already taken bandages from my family and all the food. Probably makes me the worst son ever. Especially since I didn't actually need all the food in the end. Do I give it? To, to raise the nails. Are those nails you Go and get those Thanks. damn nails. There are so many so how's Bianca? ways um, I could have said that. Badly. She's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Ooh. Maybe we'll see each other there. God of God. Anyway, you mustn't keep death. you. I'll be on my way. That sword is truly beautiful. I was going to say, I think I've got someone else's eye. Fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. Is it awful that when I looked at Teresa, one thought was, but does she have a brewery? Can I have a go? <laughs> Dad! We did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. You haven't lost your skills, though. Would you like to try it? Yes! Sir, what good is a sword to a Let commoner? Let try it. Let me try it! Okay, come on! Surely I can do better than that. You still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work, very fine. 
A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Sman? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. He's polite, but he's I'm giving sure off. Our will cross again. Bad guy will. vibe. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. It's been an honor, Sir Isma. Have a safe journey to Sasso. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. A long, peculiar history. <laughs> that was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Dad? Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. You talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in scallets, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them, or beat them. Meet. You have to keep going on about it. <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. Just in case? Okay, that's... A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? Oh... Okay. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry. And what about you? Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her and we'll follow right behind. I'll go with you. No. You do what I say right now. Give the sword to Sir Radzik. If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me. What do you mean if anything ha- Okay. That was not a very secure...
Okay. Bad guy. Bald bad guy. Dad's kicking backside here. Behind you! Oh, guy on a horse! Oh, you're kidding. I'm going to kill you. A lot. Soldier behind. I don't know if I've got the sword to quit. Ride to Talberg. Get a horse. Get a horse. I've got a. Where, where am I going? Where am I going? I, ju I don't even know. I've come down here. I'm guessing just down. Oh, it's just one. Problem is, this is just one with armor and training in sword. Oh, God. Are those, are those friendlies or unfriendlies? They look unfriendly. They look unfriendly. Whoa! Ah, yeah. Run! Run! Okay. Oh, no. Okay. This is. Oh, I'm gonna die. Okay. 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 Oh no! 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 This is bad. This is bad. Okay. Oh god, he's... Oh, there's two of them! There's two of them! Run! Where am I running to? Where am I running to? I need a horse! It said horse! Okay, no, 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 no. Ow! Ow! Run! Just... I'm bleeding! I think... Oh! Okay, that's not good! Okay, he said, jump down the wall. Jump down the wall and free. Flee. Jump down the wall and flee. Which wall? Don't even, don't even look behind. Don't even look behind. How about this? This way! This is it! This is it! This has got to be it. Okay, we're ahead of him. We're ahead of him. We're ahead of him. Find a horse. Don't touch me or I'll kill you. Oh, God. What? Go to hell, you child of beast. Help! 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 What am I? Who am I? Who am I? I'm, I can't turn. I cannot turn. 
Did, did, she's away. She's <laughs> away. Can I take a horse? I want to take one of these horses. I want to take one of these horses. This is not a way to. Well, there's a bow user. There's a bow. Oh, ow! I can't stop turning. I'm a mountain. I tried to mount it. I tried to. Oh God! What? I'm trying to mount it. I'm pressing. Okay. We just run, 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 run. Ride to Talmberg, get a horse. Yes, indeed, get a horse. Try not to break your leg on the way. All right. So, I have this odd premonition. Oh, yeah. Don't touch me, or I'll kill you. Shut up, beast! What language are these? Speaking. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh. No, no, no. Turn around! Oh my god! Please! What, 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 what? Turn around! Turn! Oh, I'm trying to disengage! Turn around! Which way am I going? Just gallop! Oh my god! There she is! She's away! She's away! Well done! Arrows! Keep galloping! Keep galloping! Can I put my sword away? Can I put it away? Oh! Keep galloping. I'm bleeding. Joy. Is there someone behind me? There is someone behind me. Oh, wait. oh God. All right. What I got to do? Just get away. Follow the road. No, don't bleed to death. Don't bleed to death. You've discovered Rovna. It's very nice. Ow! Is this where I'm going? You've discovered a shrine. Probably not. Is this where I'm going? Is it? I, I can't. I don't know if I'm going here. I can't. Oh, I'm, I'm wounded. I can't bloody run. Hello. Apparently not here. Yay! Let's make the sword again. Yeah, right, I'm gonna have you. I'm having you. I'm up. Come on, come on then. Come on then, sunshine. Okay. Oh, he's he. Okay. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, what? Okay. So. Yeah. No, 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 go faster, go faster. Yeah. Okay, no. Get that. Okay, got it. Um, so you have to put your weapon away to turn around. You, you can't disengage and run away with sword in hand because that would be sensible. You have to put the weapon away. Oh my god. Which way am I going? Which way am I going? Discover the shrine. Don't want to discover shrine. Want to keep sprinting. Keep sprinting. Am I going the right direction? Hamburg is to the left. Left. The stream. Got it. Left. Going left. This left. Or my other left. I'm assuming it's this left. Run away, ladies. I'd, I'd help you out, but I'm probably going to bleed to flee death on you. To Talmberg. Yes, flee. Can I help this person out? Run for it. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no I can't help that person out. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I'm actually bleeding to death, and apparently I'm peckish. I'm a coward. I left that poor man to die. I left my parents to die. I left everybody to die. I mean, true, I'm wounded, I'm bleeding. And I'm in a really bad way. Oh, God, and they're right on my heels. Please, stop following the road! 
Really? I'd go into the forest. They've got, they've got horses. Run away, guys. Run. I'm home. What am I stuck on? Who's pushing me? Oh, brilliant. Okay, I've managed to get to this point without being shot this time. I'm still bleeding. But left. not a, left. I'll move it. to the I left, along yeah, the yeah. stream. Yeah, left along the stream. Stay on the bloody road this time. Don't, don't get knocked off. Don't stop to interact with the poor. Oh, God, what, what's going Run on? What? For it. Horse, stay on the bloody road. Flee. Yeah, seriously, get off the road. Honestly, I would run into the forest if I were you. They're on horseback. They can't follow you in. And they're right on my tail. I can hear him. I'm not looking back because I dare not. I dare not even take a glance at the side for fear that the horse will just run for it. Constellation Cross. I have no idea what that is. I have no idea. You know what? I'm not sightseeing. Is it left? Over the street, over the street. Sorry, please get out of the way. I don't want to run you Go over. I'll kill but, um, you all. Oh, God. Why am I going slowly oh, again? Go, go, no, no, please, please, don't push me. Yeah. Come on, gallop, gallop, gallop. More bridge, more bridge. Over the bridge, over the bridge. Yeah, no, sorry, horse. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm. Run. Oh, I think the horse is tiring. I think the horse is tiring. Yeah. Or injured? Are they shooting the horse? That would make yeah. sense, wouldn't it? Oh, Come on, it's not galloping. It won't gallop. Oh, stop yeah. galloping! It's, I think it's every time I correct. Oh, yeah. no. yeah. Come on, come on, follow the gallop! Please gallop! Just gallop! Stay galloping! Oh, I did it! I did it! I think. This is where I get shot in the head, isn't it? Why are they chasing me out of curiosity? Yeah, save me, not all the people that are out there. Don't save them. Uh, I do hope they're good shots. Okay. Well, that was fun. Let's never do it again. I'm not a good horse rider. Rider. I accept that. A blacksmith. Probably not to ride a horse, though. Or I should. Any good. Ow. Someone give him a drink. And bring hot wine and bandages. I was going to say, I'd, I'd like the arrow taken out. Preferably carefully. Tell me, boy. Who are you, and where are you from? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They burned it to the ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe Tartars? Guess that's the Tartus, boss. You say. Yeah. We well, don't know. we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. I, I don't know. Grit your teeth, boy. I'm gonna pull that hair out. Yeah, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? Yeah. Gonna take that as a yes. Easy. All done. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you stand? 
I've got a hole in the leg. I'd say no. Apparently, I'm going to do... There you go. As good as new. Oh, yes. Oh, that helped. Thank you. If you idlers nothing better to do, get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage? I thought that was my stomach for a second. Sir, this is a survivor from... I heard, Robart. Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you see the insides of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? So, um, I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a strange language. They burned Scalitz to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. That's why they were they chasing me. They could be those me. Cumans of Sigismunds. They didn't want it the said they came to, to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Sacking Gutenberg must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Skalos is a small castle, sir. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. Indeed, sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. You think we're next in line? Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry, son of the Scalitz blacksmith. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you for risking your neck to warn us. Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. As you command, sir. Okay, I'm really hungry, really tired, but I'm not injured or bleeding, which is a good thing. Hello? And I'm supposed to be going to speak to Sir Robert, who seems to be down there. Um, hi, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing. You've done well, doing. I'm sorry no. for your loss. You must be all done in. Why don't you go to the kitchen and have a good meal? You're the Sorrow is Scottish. easier to bear on a full stomach. That is... I heard about your father. They say he was a swordsmith who moved to the countryside and made horses. That is true. Oh, go with Sir Robert to I the I can't understand kitchen. why he'd waste his talents, but... He had a fine reputation. It's a great law. Okay. Ah, uh, milady. You are fortunate our good lady Stephanie of Talmberg has graced us with her presence. My lady, I'm honored. So this is our brave young man. Welcome, lad. Bojena here will take care of you. No doubt you're tired and hungry. <laughs> Indeed. How could he not be, poor soul? After everything he's been through, he must be as hungry as a bear. Aren't you, young master? You have no idea. Yes. Here you are, then. Eat your fill. And a little wine to wash it down. Thank I've you, my lady. Won't say no. Okay. When you're done, you can go and rest with the grooms in the outer bailey. No, that won't do, Sir Robard. After all he's been through, he deserves a proper bed. Let him sleep in a lodge in the courtyard. Certainly, my lady. Ooh. Young Henry here is overwhelmed by your generosity. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, my lady. May God reward you for your kindness. Eat up now. You're in capable hands, so I'll leave you to it. Good night. Good night. Good night, ma'am.
When you've done, you can sleep in the bedchamber of the courtyard lodge. And don't forget to take off those filthy boots before getting into bed. Okay. What would happen if I didn't? I mean, I'm, I, I'm going to take your advice. Okay. Oh. Okay, my head feels a bit... Eat! Go to the courtyard lodge and sleep there until morning. <sighs> Must eat. Must. Yeah. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to. Eat. I'm trying it. I'm picking it up. I'm picking it up. I can, I can eat any of this stuff. Can I? Can I have... Oh, I'll tell you what. Let, let's just... Where was it? Lentil mash. Nourishment nine. That only lasts... Right, we're going to eat that. Um, let's have some cabbage. Oh, cabbage is always good for us. Yes, it's it. Marigold decoction. Durability always. Within one minute, we'll cure light wounds or dispel hangover. All right, we don't have wounds. Onions give me... Right, no, no. Cabbage. That is what I need. Oh, okay. Whoa. You've learned food. I've learned food. I'm an expert at... Can I just take... I am... I'm ridiculously hungry. Are you okay with me just... Snaffling everything? When you said I was as hungry as a bear... Well, it wasn't you. It was... It was... It was oh, roast duck. Roast duck. Nice. Actual meat. Hey! Oh, what? 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 Oh, God, you scared me. Don't do that. Well, they were telling me off for taking the roast duck. I was like... I was about to start apologizing profusely. Jeez. Yes. When it was was this for everyone? Am I am I being am I being greedy? I just have an apple as well. I just I'll take an apple. Yeah. Just one apple. Didn't they say wine? Where was the wine? Ooh, wine. Okay, also, right, I'm still right, let's see. What have I got? What have I got? What roast duck. Roast duck. Nourishment 26. Oh, it makes me sleepy, though. Does me... Well, I'm going to bed anyway, aren't I? Only lasts for two days. How many do I have? Three. Only lasts for two days. Let's get my nourishment up so I feel better tomorrow. Oh, what about wine? This, again, reduces my energy. Oh, it's durable for ages. It can lead to fun, song, drunken blabbering, uh, loss of memory, and empty perp... Be a good idea, although it increases my health. That could be good. My speech and charisma are really, really not so good. How am I doing? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! The nodding is because I'm tired. The nodding is because <sighs> I'm tired. <sighs> Jesus! I could do with some sleep. I, I got really it. I really do with some sleep. Ooh, I can also eat from the pot. Uh, oh, I should have done that rather than eat. Talk to the cook. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, I, wanted to, I wanted to talk to the cook. Hello? Where can I sleep again? Oh, he's already told me. Uh, where can I buy something? We'll talk tomorrow. We'll, t we'll talk tomorrow and we'll trade tomorrow. I need to find my... God, I need to find my bed. Right. Uh, what happens if I accidentally... You know, I say accidentally. Go to the courtyard lodge and sleep there until morning. And the courtyard lodge would... E okay, there. I am going to get lost. I'm going to get lost, and I'm going to wake up. Oh, God. Oh, God. Court lo courtyard Lodge. Can anyone tell me where the Courtyard Lodge is? Uh, oh, there's there's the baker. Where have I come in and out? Could I oh, I'm so going to get lost. I am so. Courtyard Lodge. Is this a Courtyard Lodge? It's not. That's not. Okay. Hello? Courtyard Lodge? Not a... That's not a lodge. That's not a lodge. Where's the court... Is it, is it up? Is it... Is it up? This... Oh, I'm so... Right. One of these? One of these? Was it one of these? This looks like a lodge. This looks like a lodge. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I am. Oh, wait. Uh, I've got something on my, my activity giver. I don't want an activity giver. I want unexplored places. I don't want unexplored places. Do I want unexplored places? I want to find my bed. I want to find my bed.
Is this the lodge? Sit. Oh, this is not it, is it? Where, where's... Um... Hi. Be a bit any... more careful. I'm trying to find my bed before I fall asleep, and I don't think it's any of these. These look lived in by someone else, which is probably going to get me in a huge amount of trouble, isn't it? Yes, it is. I'm running around looking for my bed. You're in a private area. Okay, no. So I get told if I'm in a private area. All right, then. Okay. Hello. Is this... This has got a lodgy kind of look to it, doesn't it? Does this have a lodgy kind of look? <sighs> oh. You're in a... No, this is a private area. What about this? What about this? Is this... This looks slept in as well. It looks very slept in. This is a private area. It shouldn't be here. Oh! When it... It appears... Right, wait. When it... When I got here, it... That can't be it, can it? This is definitely not a lodge. It's like... It's telling me... A, 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 A. Right, 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 right. It, I think... I think I'm looking at the right place. I think I am looking at the right place. Yes, indeed! What? I hear you I, came from Skelly. I get the feeling. This is indeed it. I found my bed, I think. I'm actually going to take my boots off. And I gotta remember to 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 to, to, to put them back on again. Alright. What do I do? Sit? Okay, I'm gonna sit. I'm sitting. Please tell me I'm in the right place. I don't wanna wake up and get arrested. Sleep, inventory, or get up? Okay, no, we want to... I want to close the door. It's just, this looks lived in. It looks a little lived in. It look, oh, my God. Close the door. Looks a little lived in. But I think I'm just going to fall over and collapse. No one's going to get mad if I accidentally sleep in the wrong place, are they? Oh, my God, look how much I'm... All right, let's do it. Now I'm a little nervous. How long do you want to sleep? We're... Oh, I want to sleep till the morning, surely. 6, 6, 8, 5 a.m. Comfort, 50%. Oh, so it's not the most comfortable place. Nourishment, 73. Oh, my nourishment's pretty good. Okay, energy, 20. Health, 100. Uh, what, how do I do... Oh. Oh, right. I can see it's... Right, the, the, the comfort won't go over... Right. If I want to get energy back, all my energy... You can't sleep any longer now. I have to get up at 7... I have to get, if I sleep for 12 hours, that's a long time. That'll give me 95 energy. I sort of feel like I want to get up a little earlier. All right, no, let's, let's just let's do it as long as possible. Get maximum energy back. Yes, indeed. Does, is this going to make me slightly more charismatic? Ooh. Oh, please don't tell me I'm going to wake up somewhere. Today the patrols will be doubled. Keep your eyes peeled. If you see anything out of the ordinary, report it immediately. Understood? Yes, sir. Yes? It is I, Henry. Forgive the intrusion. I didn't wake you, boy, did I? Uh, my lady... Uh, um... No, no, not at all. But what brings you here at this hour? I thought you could do with a little wine. It's just what you need to help you sleep. I'm a little worried about getting caught in this I room really, um, with... Thank you. You really shouldn't. You could have sent a sermon. I was going to. But to tell you the truth, I couldn't sleep either. I thought of you while saying my prayers. How awful it must have been for you. I came to offer you solace, to let you know you're not alone. Thank you. Thank you kindly. You're welcome. Now, Henry. Oh! I know this is all very Kay. new and strange for you. But I want you to feel at home here. 
You're not to worry about anything except getting better. Go on, worried. God knows you've been through a terrible ordeal. I know what it is to be left alone in the world. Although your loss is much greater. But with God's help, the pain will ease in time. And it can help to talk about it. If you feel like it. Talking is okay. I just, tell the story of the raid. I can't. I just can't talk about it. No, I can't. I can't. Talk. Talk. Keep talking. Get lots of grisly details that will be quite horrific and disturbing. You might be right, my lady. I'll tell you what happened. It was terrible and unexpected. The day started just like any other. Father sent me into town on some errands. I went to the... T Ooh. I went to the tavern for ale and met my sweetheart Bianca there. Ooh, 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 ooh. I could mention. Oh. A fellow oh. by the name of Kunish. Oh, there's a timer. Who sent me to collect it from him? Only Kunish had no intention of paying. It got a bit heated, as often happens when there's money involved. Kunish still wouldn't cough up the coin. Father was too generous for ooh. his own good, letting even a scoundrel like that buy on credit. Oh. When I'd done all the errands, I headed back home. I promised father I'd help him with his work, and I was looking forward to it. He was forging a sword for Sir Radzik. Okay. Me and father talked about life. Sir Radzik came looking for the sword. I'd secretly been learning sword fighting. Sir Radzik came to look at the sword. Y the sword was taking shape when Sir Radzik himself came to have a look at it. He praised father's work and said that with his smithing skills, he could easily make a living in Prague or Vienna. You don't say. Yes, I'm saying. But Sigismund's horde was already on the horizon, ready to attack the town. Okay, I saw smoke on the horizon. There was a huge horde of the town. Cumans, there were Cumans. There were actually Cumans. There were. Sigismund's cavalry was composed of Cumans. They're That's... diabolical barbarians yes. from the east with no regard for the rules of warfare. Bloodthirsty cutthroats. The very fact Sigismund has them with him shows what a tyrant he is. Well... Ooh. I don't know. Oh, really? And then death descended on Scalitz. Okay. I saw them kill my girl Bianca. They killed my father and mother. Did I didn't necessarily see the death of Bianca, did I? Father told me to take shelter in the castle while he went to get mother. She was stranded in the town, surrounded by Sigismund butchers. And then I saw him knocking down one human after another. I never saw him fight like that. But then the leader of Sigismund's raiding party, a knight in full armour, saw father and charged at him. I cut down my father without a thought. And then he turned on my mother. And he murdered her in cold blood. You poor boy. All right. May the Lord have mercy on their souls. I ran to the castle like our neighbours to take cover, but I didn't make it. I had to find another way to save myself. The men on the battlements called down to me to flee to Talmberg and warn you. I was lucky I knew a concealed path around the castle. I needed a horse. I ran for my life. Cuma right, uh, okay, no, you know what? Let's just stick. Apparently, she wants... I needed a horse to get to the safety of Talmberg and to warn you all. And with all that was happening, you thought of others like a good Christian. Okay, no, I'm, I don't want her to like me too much. It was Teresa, the mill wench. She'd been caught by a gang of Cuman savages who planned to violate her. I had Sir Radzik's sword, and even though there were several of them and they were better armed, I had to try and save her. I wanted there to be at least one person I'd helped. And I succeeded, even though it almost cost me my life. After that, I stole a horse from him and rode off. Acquired? Valiant knight. Acquired? I'll never forget the horror. It will haunt me for the rest of my life. That's terrible. How could something like that happen? God alone knows why he lets such things happen. Oh, you poor boy. I understand your grief, but God is not to blame for the ills of this world. That is the work of Satan and those who do his bidding. Those who are corrupted by greed, envy and pride. You must not lose faith, whatever life brings. Fate has 
not been merciful to me and my husband either. Although in comparison to the horrors you went through. I was young when I married my husband. It was my father's wish. Divish was a lot older than I, but a woman must bear her lot. Shortly after our marriage, before I even got a look at Talmberg, the castle was stormed and my husband was imprisoned. Really? My husband had some quarrel with Sir Havel Medek of Valdek, who decided to resolve it by force. He stormed the castle, burned down the village of Probislavets, and killed many of our men, even the old Chamberlain. He imprisoned my husband in the castle and put his own garrison there. That's awful. I was barely 18 years old, and all of a sudden, I was left alone with Sir Robert. We didn't know what to do. We went to Prague to appeal to the king and sought help from Divish's friends, but all to no avail. We tried for years, but it seemed I was destined to be left alone and my husband to rot in jail in his own castle. Years, you say? Seven years. That's how long it took before Havel was condemned as an enemy of the crown. And even then, he refused to surrender the castle and release my husband. In the end, I raised the money to pay a ransom. And only then, by the grace of Lord Jesus, did I finally lay eyes on my husband once more. Seven years. And was Havel punished for it? Never. And after seven years, my husband returned to me an infirm old man. Oh. Sir Divish seems like a good, strong man. Well, certainly. Who I do and not he, want to He has accept. many concerns. He had to rebuild Talmberg. After he was released, the king appointed him Burgrave of Prague Castle, and he was very busy. He had no time for me at all. But at least we were in the city, and there was something going on. And now, we're here. My lady, you're still young and beautiful. Your best years are still ahead of you. Okay. Ex nay. Would that that was With true, the flattery! Lad. This is Would not a tavern maid. But what am I doing bothering you with this? You have troubles enough of your own. I'll go and let you sleep. Thank you. I enjoyed our little talk, Henry. Good night, and God bless. Good night, my lady. Oh, yeah. Because I didn't have enough troubles in my life. No, I didn't, did I? No. Oh, don't smile. Wake up. You don't want to miss this. What is it? Am I? What's happening? Come to the battlements. One of our patrols reported a company heading here from Skelets. 